this is my last one. I gotta make my kids some breakfast. Mm -hmm. Oh, shoes. Oh, dang, we ain't got no syrup. But hey, I gotta go to the store. A lot of money. This this masculine is trying to see is it worth leaving this karmic feminine for for divine feminine because this karmic feminine is doing everything to him pleasing him everything that he likes and all types of stuff like that and he's wondering like I can't leave what I you feel me she's giving me everything that I want so if I come over here it's like I'm either going cheat on you or something because you're not doing what I want you to do but he doesn't know what you're capable of you're not gonna be getting your energy mixed up with these goofies because that's how they're gonna have access to you and stop you from receiving what it is that you want to receive so mm -hmm. uh, they saying because you have it to give I thought you were gonna give it but it's like that's because that's the mindset that you have back then when you were being manipulated by your attacker, your first offender, your parent, guardian, whatever. And that's the cycle that you've been manipulated into believing. So now you have to get out of that cycle that whatever you have to give away because you now need it. And these are things like cars and money and a place to stay, like, I understand that you have mission and goals for your kids, but I have kids now. So why would I risk my stuff and give it to you when I need that exact thing? Like, and it's just a repetitive thing. Everything that you're manifesting and putting the work in for and waiting for, they're trying to make their life story seem so sad that you'll be like, okay, you know what? Give it to them because you're so nice and caring and kind and giving that they're using that to their advantage. And it's like, Okay, but what about me? I'm in the same position where I need a stable place to live for my kids, a bigger space over there. I need a car, this and the third. Like, so they felt like because they got rid of somebody that you were attached to, that that was going to cause you to shut down or shut up or whatever, but it only caused the confusion to be unconfused because now he's spiritually connecting with divine feminine because he didn't want to physically connect with divine feminine because he didn't want this shit to happen he didn't want motherfuckers to take him out thinking that he was switching sides and all types of stuff like that so he was like if you understand you understand you're gonna give me this time to you know detach myself from them so they saw how he was moving and they knew that it's like oh you not working you not this and that and you're trying to uh you know, so it's like because he agreed to do this stuff with these karmics, like, let's just say, like, when you're in a game, this was worse than being in a game, being attached to these karmics because they did not want to receive the karma because they already, you feel me? <laughs> he was trying to detox. He was trying to detox from these karmics because he saw divine feminine for who she was and realized that if it came push up, these karmics couldn't do. You feel me? Y'all ain't putting food in his fridge. Y'all not giving him gas money. Y'all not de-stressing him type sorts. <laughs> Saying that this karmic thought she had it in the bag. Um, because divine feminine removed her is removing her energy. We gonna let that slide. If you know, you know. Uh, they said go back to the. Yeah, it's the same thing that happened with this first masculine. Um.
Yeah, that's my baby. Can I help you? Uh-huh. What do you want? Um, can you turn to something? Okay, give me a second, okay, baby? Okay. That's even better. I ain't got to make no... Bye, baby. Give me a second. Oh, my goodness. No, because I ain't moved very well. <laughs> Take your time. Because it's like you're tired of spiritually connecting with people. You want these masculines to do it in person. You're ignoring these common feminine attacks. You're listening to this masculine because you know what it is. <laughs> my dang on me the back of my knee hurt so yes you're starting to speak up you're not addressing the ignorant karmic energy you're just speaking up and showing this masculine that you are connected with him you have been receiving his messages it's just been a confusion because you're attached to this karmic feminine so you know and then because this karmic wanted to throw it in your face so bad they low-key be exposing themselves, and that just give you the fuel you need to then further, uh, you know? <laughs> Big three is here. Um, There is a deadline. They said we're not going to tell you when the deadline is because we need you to, to be sure that you want to make that decision. Um... And if you miss your opportunity, you miss your opportunity. And if this is your masculine, then your or you know, I'm sorry for the men out there. I keep speaking in feminine terms, but if you flip flop your energies, if it fits for you, then da da da. da. Mm. This is what you deserve. Stick to your path. Found find your way. Yeah, it's very important. <laughs> A decision. And you should trust those around you. So <laughs> He said, we going to see. What's today? What's today? I think this. <laughs> Bitch, ain't nobody pocket watching you. You told me. Anywho. So, we going to see what today brings. What tomorrow brings. What's today? Yeah. Okay, I almost said something bad. 